as I did before, you don't get to start shit and then just walk away. Apologize like a man. Oh, really? Greetings to the Fallen. It is I, your demigod, Mordecai the Cross, also known as your president. And... <coughs> uh, that's what happens when you smoke too much pot. Anyways, I was... I was gonna say something. Oh! So now I remember what I was going to say. So Mordecai Ladross, a particular person that has this page called The Real Mordecai Ladross, or some shit like that, continues to post lies and all kinds of other bullshit about me and about this group that he's the leader of, of this cult, known as the Cauldronites. And these Cauldronites keep on lying about me and uh, various things such as their group so I at one point explained this on my fan page the original Mordecai Lacrosse and now I'm gonna explain it here on YouTube so I your great leader Mordecai Lacrosse was in this YouTube this Facebook group not YouTube sorry in this Facebook group oh Oh, where was I? Oh, yeah, I was in this Facebook group. Sorry, I forgot where I was at. It might be all the arsenic that I drank this morning that's making me forget what I was saying. I'll have to look that up. I think, I don't know if arsenic causes memory loss. Anyways, I digress. So... As I was saying, I was in this Facebook group where these cauldronites reside. And I pointed out, yes, your great demigod pointed out that Ouija boards aren't evil and that demons didn't exist. And supposedly, even though they're pagan, they freaked out that I said demons don't exist. They seem to think they do. Which is a very hilarious thing for a pagan to say that they believe in demons and I'm pretty sure they believe in the devil too. Which the devil is real. She's right behind me right now. That's beside the point. You still owe me four souls. Well, I'll get you the four souls. I, yeah, I still owe the devil four, four souls. So if you would like to sell your soul... Um, write to us here at the Asylum 2, 666 Paper Street, West Legion, Texas, 798050. And we'll get to that. So anyways, these Cauldronites got pissy that I pointed out that AA was a Christian cult com specifically designed, if you will, to push people. Into Christianity. Okay, Joker. And so. Okay, that's penguin. Um, what was I? Sorry, arsenic messing with my mind. Oh, so. I just pointed out that AA was a cult and was created by this group called the Oxford Group to force people into Christianity by using an illness. And I said, you know, there's other rehab organizations that are better than AA and do not push a religious a fucking agenda. And that the Ouija boards weren't evil and that Zozo didn't exist. And because I like to use words like shit, donkey raping, shit eater, fuck face, fucking fuck, fuck, I don't know. Just because I use curse words, they got pissy. Supposedly there's young children there. Even though Facebook policy... Is you gotta be a teenager like 13 and over, so trust me, 
they've heard worse in their parents' bedroom as their mother was fucking the pastor. I'm just saying. They've heard worse. Um, I need a chimichanga. Uh, anyways, so as I was saying, is I'm not crazy. Oh wait, no, that's 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 not what I was saying. I am nuts. Oh, so as I was saying, I was kicked out of this group for pointing out that AA was a cult and that Ouija boards aren't evil, demons don't exist, and Zozo only comes out on Tuesdays and has sex with everyone. And so, because of this, I was kicked out of the group. Now, I mistakenly thought this one dude was a neo-Nazi, and I guess it is possible to not be a neo-Nazi and share stuff from a neo-Nazi group. That's why we should always fact-check. I said fact-check, not fast-check. But if you'd like to send me a check, um, email me. I gladly accept donations. I won't pay you back at all, whatsoever. I will most likely scam you out of more money, especially if you send me your social security number. Just say your social security number, and I'll make sure nobody else sees it. In fact, comment your social security number and all your personal information down below. So they kick me out of the group. And then they make all kinds of false accusations and lies and whatnot. And then claim that I've stolen Valor. So let's talk about that part. Because that part's a complete utter lie too. Now, at one point, my dear demons and succubus and succubi, I was going to be full-fledged Army National Guard. That's before I was like, no, that's not my thing. But because of certain physical conditions, such as, you know, something that particularly happened that's none of anyone's business, but I can't hear properly out of this ear, like, seriously, you could scream orgasm into the ear, and I probably wouldn't fucking hear. Even though nobody, as far as I know, screamed orgasm. Into my ear. Or, where was I? And that, children, is how babies are made. Oh, wait, that's not where I was. So, anyways. The point being is how much could a woodchuck would if it would... No, no. Rewind that, reverse that. Wrong channel! Okay. So, anyways. I was going to be Army National Guard... I somewhat technically was, even though I hadn't gone through the official channels and injury dealing with this, you know, the ear, and then the fact that I was bipolar disorder and I didn't tell them, well, I obviously didn't go further past that. So I haven't stolen valor or anything like that. I was going to do it, but you know, you can't do it if you're um, sexy. I mean, wrong channel, crazy. Or if you are crazy, you have to have sex with the president. Whoops. Wrong channel. Um, you have to hide your craziness. You can't, you know, be open about it like me. So no, at no point. Now, of course, they claim they have this screenshot of, if you will. God, the hair's all messed up. Anyways. They have, supposedly have a screenshot of me drinking arsenic poisoning. Oh, wrong channel. Um, no. They have supposedly a screenshot of a message that didn't even happen. Because I have a screenshot of 17 hookers dead at Elvis Fowler's place. Oh, wait. No, sorry. Wrong channel. <sighs> Maybe that was the right channel. If you know a dead hooker, contact Aldous Valor. So the point being is that their supposed screenshot of the message is photoshopped or perhaps they created another fake page. But there you go. There's the full story. And now you know how crack damages the brain. I mean, methamphetamines. I mean, arsenic. I mean, crack cocaine. Until next time, 
stay on drugs. At no point does the Fallen or the Asylum at all support the usage of drugs. You, and n neither is this the opinion of New Revolution Studios or YouTube Associates. Until next time, stay wicked. And um, vote or die. Bye.